How is everybody doing today? My name is Master Zero, and in today's video, we are going to be reacting to What If You Swallowed the Most Venomous Snake by Meet Arnold. Alright, so, uh, I was scrolling through the, uh, the trending page, and I thought, I don't know what I could possibly react to that's not PewDiePie or a music video. But um, I kept, I finally kept scrolling down and I found uh, this one and I've never seen Meet Arnold before. So uh, it's, it's animated and I'm a sucker for animated uh, videos. So I figured I'd give it a shot. So without any further ado, here is What If We Swallowed the Most Venomous Snake Ever by Meet Arnold. Meet Arnold. Hey. After Hi. tasting the foods of Asia and Europe, he returned Fun. home to try something even more exotic. Get your ass down here and choose what you'll eat first. Come on, Arnold. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. One bite from a baby cobra can kill a three-ton elephant. Oh my There's god. There's almost no air in this its This is stomach, very fast-paced, by the way. But when diving, snakes can hold their breath for up to ten hours. Gastric wow. juices will digest it in one and a half to two hours, as if it was a chicken. Everything what? that remains will have to go through the anus. Oh, Fun. Look, it's venom. If it doesn't contact with your blood, it can't harm you. What the hell? Though as soon as it gets into an ulcer or a cut, the venom's effects are instant. Paralysis, convulsions, Fun. and after 15 minutes, you're a goner. But only if you don't use an antidote. <laughs> Okay, who let the frog in? One gram of Philobate's terribilis venom can kill a whole city worth of people. Should a small animal wow. step on the trail of this frog, the toxin will kill him instantly. Even instantly? if you get a small drop of the poison on your skin, boom, you're dead. The frog will pass out 30 seconds after hey, getting into the We ain't stomach, talking about frogs. I thought we were talking about snakes. A painful death yeah. will be waiting for you. And an antidote for this poison doesn't exist, so you oh, can stop no. looking. And if a scorpion's poison is added Please to the probate's poison, Poor its Arnold. strength will increase by 12 times. Any last oh. wishes? Do you want the viewers to subscribe and leave a like? I see. Doesn't matter. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye? What just happened? Wait. I want to watch this one. All right, so uh, the first one was very fast-paced. I couldn't even process reacting to it. So uh, the the one that popped up on the on the screen after that one, I'd I'd figured I'd watch that one too because it, it's the same subject, right? Is what does venom do to your blood? Same person, same everything, and it's three minutes instead of just one minute. So hopefully it's not fast paced. But uh, I blame the kids. It's a new generation. Everything, all these cartoons are fast paced. <laughs> so without any further ado, again here is what does venom do to your blood by Meet Arnold again. How do you like Australia, uh, oh God. Arnold? Oh, God! <laughs> Don't move! It looks like that's an inland taipan. Hey, dumbass! That's the most <laughs> venomous land snake on Earth! The taipan's oh my God. is 180 times more toxic than a cobra's. A drop oh my. the size of a pinhead can kill 1,000 rats. And 44 milligrams of this venom, which the snake injects in a single bite, can kill over 100 Arnold's. Right oh my. Useless. The Taipan does not slink away after the first bite like other snakes, but continues with a series of lightning fast, oh my super precise God. attacks to finish off the victim. These 13 millimeter long fangs just injected a powerful hematoxin into your blood that prevents it from clotting. This leads oh my. to internal bleeding. You lose control of your body. Your limbs stop obeying. Breathing like, oh, becomes stop. difficult. And convulsions begin soon after. Help me, oh, don't worry, Arnold. That's not blood. That's urine. Your muscle cells literally begin to dissolve and leave oh my your kidneys. God. Due to this, your urine becomes red. If you don't take an antidote within 30 minutes, then for the next eight hours, during what's left of your worthless life, you will experience <laughs> hellish pain that will make you beg to be finished off sooner. Oh no! The first part of the simulation is complete. Oh my God. Snake. Let's say mercury. And one more breath. Well done. You've inhaled exactly 2.5 grams of mercury. 
You can find as much in two mercury thermometers if you breathe in their evaporated mercury when you inhale, just like you did right now. Or if you fill a small room with thermometers and trample them thoroughly, it will take you around wow. one hour and 250,000 thermometers to breathe in the same dose of mercury and die. Wow. And die just straight up. This is also mercury, doophole. <laughs> if you drink a glass of ordinary mercury, the maximum that can happen oh, is you no. might get a severely upset stomach and diarrhea. But if the mercury oh, bad, is right? finely fragmented, you will die in pain. When ingested, tiny droplets form hazardous soluble salts. Your body temperature rises to 40 degrees Celsius. You begin to shiver, and your chest and stomach start ripping apart from pain. Also, oh my. don't forget to add extreme salivation, vomiting, and diarrhea to the mix. Fun. If you don't bump your stomach immediately, death will come after 10 to 30 excruciatingly painful days. The second part days? of the simulation, a virus has snuck in somehow. Don't move, Arnold. Do not move. Oh, no. <laughs> Put your finger up if you like this video. Send it to your friends and subscribe to my channel. Okay. There are many more exciting experiments coming with our friend Arnold. Awesome. All right. So uh, I'm probably going to straight up subscribe to that channel because that was amazing. I love that. Like the, the quirky narration and like just the constant pain coming from Arnold. It's just something about that that is really, really funny. I love it so much. And like I said, the, the quirkiness of the, uh, the announcer was just the icing on the cake. That was the best part of this video or videos, I should say. But man, that was funny. I loved it. <laughs> Oh, uh, so thank you everybody so much for watching. If you like this video, feel free to leave a like down below because it makes me feel all warm and fuzzy on the inside. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more awesome videos like this one. So with that said, I have been Master Zero. Y'all guys have been fantastic, and I will see y'all in the next episode. Later days. Later days.